Merry, merry, merry Christmas. So happy. I mean, I'm, I don't know, as a child, I've loved Rudolph so much that my Christmas is never complete uh, without this song. So now uh, let me introduce schools to all of you. We have a few uh, children going to join on the project. I'm just waiting for them. Well, schools is an ed tech startup, which is recognized by the government of India and helping schools, training institutes meet genuinely interested parents. Schools helps parents in searching, exploring, comparing multiple institutes, scheduling their appointments in the education sector. It's actively encouraging learning and knowledge development with blogs, webinars and events. And our CEO has a real a great vision for schools. And we have already over uh, 4,000 schools affiliated to this. Mm, unfortunately, because today is Christmas, so a lot of them are on holidays. Mm, but this program is going to be recorded and shown all over. And let's do a wonderful program. Our panelists have had a great opportunity to connect with our extensive parent community. And today we have Snehal Malpani, who's a profound entrepreneur, celebrated author and leadership coach. She's been an integral part of the learning and development industry for 15 years and hails from Nagpur, uh, Maharashtra. Her journey has allowed her to enkindle more than uh, 30,000 lives so far. Been affiliated with uh, business giants mentioned in the Fortune 500 in various capacities. She's also the founder and CEO of Skills Venetia, a platform that uh, will help you upskill your uh, skills. Her life experiences, wisdom, ideologies, have been beautifully crafted in a book, Hold On, the story of her surviving services and her personal and professional on the verse are solely based on the development as well as the progression of humanity. Nehal's efforts are indeed overall and inclusive growth. Her work has gained national and international recognition. She believes in uplifting people for the personal national good and she has been honoured as the mentor, chief speaker, honorary guest and chief facilitator on many, many occasions. And, um, you know, many noble initiatives and she's uh, actually mentored more than 50 startups, yeah? And the life she leads is the principle of Vichar, Uchar and Vyavahar. And we'll ask her to explain that. Many thanks for joining us to make uh, India and the globe a better world. This event is based on Christmas, the time of sharing gratitude, care and affection. Let's begin. So Snehal, according to you, uh, what are some of the ways in which a person can express his or her, uh, you know, um, gratitude? Because that's very, very important. Gratitude can be expressed in various ways. I, I'll go by the book that uh, that says that, uh, you know, there are five ways that people exp express their emotions. So the first thing is saying it. So you can always say thank you. You can express it by uh, just, just telling people that you're grateful. So I think telling people uh, and expressing how happy you are and how they have uh, really helped you is one way and the most effective way, something that one should never skip. Uh, do something for people. So you can probably, uh, you know, compliment them with their favorite things by gifting them. You can cook something, you can send gifts, you can serve the community with food to say orphans or any other social work, donate. And um, I think <laughs> the best best way to express gratitude towards parents is just keeping your rooms clean for that matter <laughs> and finishing off your uh, lunch boxes. Um, oh, lovely, yes. Uh, that, that's very important and uh, people don't realize that this is one of the sweetest ways that one could do it. Yeah, um, moms are always constantly on your head. Right, absolutely. So now uh, we know that always... how to say, I mean, you've just mentioned mm -hmm. that, you know, how to express gratitude, how mm -hmm. to be grateful. But could you tell us why is it necessary to be grateful? Why should we be grateful? Uh, you've frozen, Snehal. Because, I, right, because it is directly linked with happiness. Am I audible? Yes. When we express gratitude, uh, that, that is something that we do because we are happy. It's directly linked with happiness. Only when you're happy, you have this realization that, oh my God, I should go ahead and thank. So number one, uh, it, it uh, gives you the realization of you being happy and when you express your gratitude it makes the other people also feel happy because now they know that yes you have the realization of what they've done so that way it makes you social it, it helps you become friendly with people and uh, why it is done is because it's simply one way of uh, letting people know and feel that they are special and it simply gives them that appreciation of them being in your life so hence gratitude is very important absolutely it said that gratitude is shown towards others but how can we help 
uh, how does it help the person expressing his gratitude all right you say i'm i'm grateful to you but how does it help the person who's giving this does it upl- uplift him yes absolutely because uh, when you're expressing gratitude as i've said you have that realization that you have got something and when you have that uh, realization that you've received something it it builds a positive attitude in you it it heals you from within because then you know that you have people around you who are doing things for you so eventually you start feeling uh, more secured and you become aware of whatever privileges that you have in life so that way it heals you it makes you feel more confident and then it also removes the anxiety within you because then you know that you're not left alone there are people around you who are there to help you who are there with you and because then there is positivity all around because when you express gratitude others are also very very happy about it because of that positivity around uh, you also become very very optimistic about your life and obviously naturally then you know one tends to become more polite and kind towards other because you've always been in the receiving end and now you want to be on the giving end also so that is the impact that gratitude the little word has on your life so okay thank you has been a part of our beings for a very long time now should one say thank you every time and why why is it so important to say thank you children you can ask questions yeah so um, i think thank you should be a part of your everyday routine i mean it should be a part of your living you know uh, so ju- just uh, i i'll give you example say uh, you get hurt with something and it's an ouch that you know you happen to say so similarly when something someone is doing something for you it should be thank you that comes out naturally so it should become a part of your everyday routine thing uh, so you cannot thank people who help you with whatever maybe lending you a pencil maybe lending you an eraser uh, maybe offering you a seat uh, public transport so you can always thank your parents every day for parents for uh, you can thank your domestic help children every yes. day for coming yes. even in the cold look at delhi look at the you know the frost over here for being a part of you know cleaning your house we, we should be so fortunate you know that uh, we have this kind of avail- things available in india outside you have to do everything yourself yes absolutely so but but we also need to understand that you know we, we end up teaching students or children to say thank you whenever anybody is doing anything for them but but let's not make it very very um, robotic so realize understand that what they're doing is uh, really important for you and just feel that gratitude feeling that gratitude in the beginning is very very important and not just simply saying thank you otherwise it will reflect when you're saying it all right everyone so, is now trying hard to spend their day in a manner so that they can be grateful about it how can yes. this we done so i think planning especially, really especially cool. now that we hear of our another covid coming uh, hmm. how important is this you know you get my point yes it's very very important and for this i think planning plays a very very important role because only when you plan things for yourself you set goals for yourself you know what is that you want to achieve and once that is something that you know you can plan your days and months and weeks accordingly and once you've done that because that goal is always there in your mind no matter whatever situation comes up you will be in a position to come up with alternatives so even if one of your plans does not work you'll always have a backup or you will have this feeling of at least exploring what are the other options or alternative options that i can still continue to uh, work towards achieving my goals so i think planning and prioritizing things uh, is very very important prioritizing in terms of money also because you know children nowadays get pocket money and they simply want to you know keep spending because they know that every month they want to get this but also prioritizing what you really need and what things to spend upon uh, will also help thank you so much uma uh, ji uh, great it doesn't matter if you're there alone it's okay i understand that it's christmas day oh great wonderful can we have the rudolph song again please for these lovely lovely children thank you so much so start take pictures can we have the rudolph song again merry christmas children merry christmas christmas is about giving about sharing about caring it's so wonderful to have you here wow. i love you all we have snehal ji who's telling us why we should say thank you to everybody including our teachers our domestic help anybody who works for us it's very very important are we playing the song again it's one of my favorite songs <laughs>
someone gives them a chocolate or someone compliments them so we we teach them they don't understand the meaning of it they, they, they just continue saying thank yous because we have asked them to or maybe they're taught in schools to do so so it's forced in the beginning and uh, then as they grow they understand and then they start doing it intentionally they put in their efforts in saying thank yous they continue to do it it becomes uh they they start practicing it in various situations every day they start applying and uh, they express gratitude and that's when eventually it turns out to becoming a habit so it's it's a process it's not intentional it's not uh, a habit uh, that people are born with but it's a process so initially you force then intentionally with efforts you start practicing it and you practiced it so well that now it has become a part of your life it's become your habit so as you mentioned gratitude and kindness are a part of our lives and being how can we kind towards random strangers uh, tell me as you uh, you know and you dear what part of the thing that you like to do most so i'm clubbing these two questions because of paucity of time both the questions yes gratitude to strangers is a very simple thing and being humble towards them uh, and offer help whenever required and wishing them a great day or a great evening ahead no no simple. but tell me tell me sabke paas to paisa nahi hota logo ko dene ke liye supposing it's monetary help ek bachcha kya karega jo bachche hum hai sun rahe hain aajkal wo kaise help karenge matlab unke paas to nahi hota na itna wo to jyada tar kisi ko road cross kara sakte hain या इस तरह से हाउ डज इट सो ऑफरिंग हेल्प 
help is not always monetary monetary help is one of the ways that people can help each other but offering help can be very very simple just like you mentioned that helping people cross roads uh, offering people seats uh, you know in public transport uh, asking yes uh, yes. You know, yes in metros yes in metros if people are asking for addresses taking a time taking a minute out and you know uh, just reading where they want to go and guide them so these are little helps that can be easily offered being and being humble and offering these kinds of help are enough and you Best mentioned something my day, about end your day with uh, how okay so end your day with assessing what all you have done during the day so knowing reminding and remembering of your vision or your goal and measuring how you have spent the entire day and understanding how productive you've been throughout the day and whatever best whatever good has happened to you for you getting at least an opportunity to wake up in the morning and use the entire day productively you should be grateful so this is how you should actually end your day so whatever leakage was there to plan to overcome that the next day plug it and just plug it yeah absolutely another thing snehal uh, smiling is so contagious we often smile kis tarah hum apne bachcho ko sikha sakte hain nanne munne bachcho ko ki smiling ko ek habit bataiye unintentional बहुत लोगों का दिन अच्छा हो जाता है स्माइल करने से राइट सो दिस इज समथिंग दैट के नॉट बी टॉट स्पेशली टू किड्स बिकॉज किड्स विल ऑलवेज रेप्लीकेट यू स्पेशली एज पेरेंट्स एंड टीचर्स बिकॉज दोज आर द पीपल हु दे स्पेंड मैक्सिमम टाइम विद इमेजिन इमेजिन लेट मी स्टॉप यू हियर देयर आर अ होल बंच ऑफ चिल्ड्रन हु आर वाचिंग अस फ्रॉम द स्कूल नाउ इफ द टीचर गोस देयर एंड सेस गुड मॉर्निंग चिल्ड्रन एंड दे स्माइल एंड दे कीप स्माइलिंग शी इज गोइंग टू से व्हाट इज सो फनी राइट absolutely so teachers go a teacher goes in the classroom and she says good morning with a smile on her face and the students revert back with a smile saying good morning ma'am nahi wo I, wo bhi to baat hoti hai na ki kabhi kabhi oh ho match teacher ko dekh ke are aa gayi yaar <laughs> kya musibat hai this is also the thing with all of us have gone through na so right. how could that teacher also perhaps see this is about giving about caring so it's all, not only about children we yeah. as adults also need to reach out to them so what about yeah. that teacher how should we reach out to her and maybe somebody tells her bhai when you're coming to the class at least don't come and say have you done your homework or something like that you know exactly. exactly so i think uh, teachers in the first place and parents we need or, to be or you know they have teachers sometimes have that sadistic delight okay monday test and you know that yeah. is it and that means in the teeth or friday mm-hmm. tests like in dps we used to have i mean so say okay friday ko bimar padna and mm-hmm. i know children frankly i mean the other day uh, for covid i used to go to a lot of hospitals to do the you know surveys yeah. finding out whether people are this thing and any child i used to look at who's lying mm-hmm. on the bed i used to dheere se go and ask him natak kar rahe ho na ha ma'am test hai bukhar ka natak kiya nahi parents bhej dete seedhi baat hai this has happened to me so many times that i feel ki you know and then they'll say mm-hmm. pet wise and mm-hmm. then they they're ready to go to the right. hospital they're ready to do anything we are losing you yes right. children That's do you agree to, with uh, me you know do express you this sort of mind but i think the entire do you yes. agree with me children yes i can see you a lot of I, you I, smiling I, yes, yes. <laughs> कोई फिजिक्स टीचर आ गई तो गॉड ये क्यों आ गई यार ये छुट्टी क्यों नहीं ले लेती टीच बोथ चिल्ड्रन एंड टीचर्स टू रिस्पेक्ट ईच अदर एंड लव ईच अदर यू नो इट मेक अ बेटर वर्ल्ड दिस क्रिसमस इफ वी ट्राई एंड टेल देम ओके वी आल्सो नो चिल्ड्रन वी हैव गोन थ्रू द सेम थिंग हमको भी ऐसे ही देख के बोला जाता था जिंदगी में कुछ करोगी निधि मंडे अब करके दिखा दिया मेरी सारी टीचर्स सुनने करके दिखा दिया कितना और कर लूं इन अ कंट्री ऑफ 1.5 बिलियन पीपल आई एम देयर right on top right okay just managing to get to that uh, space of uh, 50 हम जो सिखा रहे उसके समझ में आ रहा है बेटा आई टेल यू वॉट द बेस्ट वे टू आई है व्हील चेयर इफ यू सी देम विद वन हैंड इफ यू सी देम बेगिंग इन फ्रॉस्ट kind of situation take out whatever you have and give it to them this whole universe children is all about giving that's what snehal ma'am has been saying hamare ko sari srishti yahi dikhati hai ki do logon ko dene se hi milta hai it is in giving that we receive remember that it is in giving look at nature the entire universe teaches you this unless you give you don't get so how do you give a smile ma'am tell uh, tell, tell our children 
सो नाउ स्माइलिंग इज समथिंग दैट कम्स फ्रॉम विद इन ये अंदर से आता है सो आई आई थिंक बोथ टीचर्स एंड स्टूडेंट्स नीड टू एंजॉय दिस प्रोसेस ऑफ लर्निंग स्माइलिंग इज वेन वेन यू फील विद इन एंड you know uh, you want to keep it to yourself and you want to cherish it you know you want to uh, restore that feeling and maybe you know just cherish it oh my god i have achieved this oh my god i have achieved this and that's when you're smiling laughter is when you want to express that happiness and that fun element uh and and you're very very expressive about it and you want to uh, you know make the other people also around you feel that liveliness feel that energy so you sharing it with other people that that's how it is both are out of happiness out of uh, the joy that you're getting but both has different uh, and both from the heart so people uh, 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 every day do what you love and do what you do so which activity do you like doing your entire day sneha ji if i ask you okay so being a mother i think uh, <laughs> i am a little biased towards motherhood spending time with my little one is something that i always enjoy but at the same time i enjoy other things as well now why i'll tell you and it is very important children for you all to know your vision in the first place once you know your vision you will obviously plan your activities accordingly and because uh, you will be whenever you doing these activities you're moving one step ahead towards achieving your goals so and when that sense of achievement at every level comes in you start enjoying that so i'll give you an example so you have your exams uh, say a month later what are you thinking is oh my god i have my exams oh my god i got am my exams and if you just worried about that exam then of course it will bring you to stress but if you have a bigger picture in life that you know what i want to become something whatever that something is for you and this exam is going to help me reach there so your entire attitude changes and then you enjoy the process of studying no no so, wait a minute wait a minute i think I'll that's give you, i'll i'll give you one live yeah. example sneha of my own daughter all right right now yes. uh, rashi was a brilliant student is a brilliant mm-hmm. student she has got 300 from dps in 12 then she okay. said i want i want to become a model right so she went into modeling she models for anjul bhandari then she said uh, now i want to crack the forces listen to me they're so confused in life then she says मुझे एयरफोर्स आर्मी इसमें घुसना है शी टुक अ कोचिंग वी पेड अ वॉपिंग अमाउंट अभी कोचिंग चल ही रही है नाउ मैडम से अब ये भी नहीं करना मुझे जगह जगह नहीं जाना अब मुझे एविएशन करना है फ्रॉम इधर स्पाइस जेट और इंडिगो आई वॉन्ट टू फ्लाइन एरोप्लेन सो चिल्ड्रेन लाइक लाइक हर आर एट लॉजर हेड्स के हमें करना क्या है वो विजन होता ही नहीं है वो कोई भी बच्चे से पूछ लो हर एक का दस महीने में एक साल में कोई और विजन बन जाता है तो yes. इसमें yes. उनका कोई क्लैरिटी है ही नहीं विजन मेरे में क्लैरिटी की थी कि मुझे सिर्फ न्यूज और सिर्फ न्यूज करनी है और वहीं से आगे जाना है ये क्लैरिटी नहीं होती लोगों में और अपना विजन बार बार बदलते हैं बच्चे क्योंकि पता नहीं क्या सकम सेंसेस आजकल के हैं कि अपना विजन बदलते हैं इसमें उनकी मदद हम कैसे कर सकते ये जो आपने एग्जाम्पल दिया है ये उनके विजन बदलते हैं ऐसा नहीं है उनके इंटरेस्ट बदलते रहते हैं सो विजन इज समथिंग दट वी कोलेबरेटिवली सिट विद देम एंड हेल्प them create their vision so creating that vision in itself is a huge amount of time no, wait, that wait, needs wait. to be spent yeah, wait, this is very important what we're talking and i don't care about the yeah. time i need yeah. to get this straight to at least as many children who are listening so that they understand kya yeah. hota hai ki mera vision as a mother hoga ki mera bachcha doctor bane engineer bane <laughs> ya ya lawyer bane ya kuch aur bane uska vision hoga ki main startup karke paise kamau mujhe nahi karni padai nahi ho rahi mujhe nahi laata nahi la sakta main 50% se upar nahi कर सकता मैं इससे ज्यादा मेहनत उसका विजन कोई और होगा तो वहां पे उसको हेल्प चाहिए उसको गाइडेंस चाहिए उसको वो कैपिटल चाहिए कि वो अपना ड्रीम शुरू कर ले एक चाय वाला भी बनके वो हजार चाय स्टोर्स खोल सकता है तो ये बातें बच्चों को सिखाई तो जाती नहीं है स्कूलों में वहां तो यही होता है ट्वेल्थ करो आई क्रैक करो एम क्रैक करो जैसे लॉलीपॉप है खा लो और वही मिल जाएगा नहीं मिलता इट इज टू मच कॉम्पिटिशन कंट्री हैज टू मेनी पीपल सो आप स्टार्टअप की वेंटरिंग करती है आप इनको कुछ आइडियाज दीजिए ये ये क्या क्या कर सकते हैं अपनी जिंदगी में स्टार्टअप ना एक ट्रेंड बन चुका है अभी जहाँ पे अभी स्टार्टअप की मेंटरिंग करते हैं वहां पे हम लोग उनके आइडियाज और उनके फंड्स uh, की क्या पोजीशन है ये देख करके उन्हें नहीं कहते हैं कि आपने स्टार्टअप में जाना चाहिए या नहीं जाना चाहिए सो द फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन वी आस्क देम इज वाई डू यू वॉन्ट टू डू दिस 
जो भी उन्होंने बिजनेस सोचा है या जो भी स्टार्टअप का आइडिया है उसके पीछे का पर्पज क्या है एंड जब हम उसमें डाइव डीप डिगिंग करते हैं तब हमें पता चलता है कि दे वॉन्ट टू डू अ स्टार्टअप बिकॉज दे थिंक दैट दे कैन बी फ्लेक्सिबल इनफ बिकॉज दे थिंक दैट दे विल नॉट हैव टू इन्वेस्ट लॉट ऑफ टाइम बिकॉज दे थिंक दैट दे आर गो नॉट बी फ्री 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 टू डू एनी थिंग दैट दे वॉन्ट एंड दिस इज द इन अप्रोप्रिएट माइंड सेट दैट दे हैव सो यहाँ पे जो क्लेंजिंग चाहिए होती है ये माइंड सेट लेवल पे चाहिए होती है आप को डॉक्टर बनना है तो डॉक्टर क्यों बनना है दो रीजन हो सकते हैं कि आपको पैसे कमाने के लिए डॉक्टर बनना है या यू जेन्यनली पैशनेट अबाउट हेल्पिंग पीपल एंड द लैटर इज गोट टू सर्व यू बेटर बिकॉज पैसे ही अगर कमाने तो शायद बहुत सारे तरीके हैं कमाने के आई आई नो अ लॉर्ड ऑफ चाय वाला हुआ अर्निंग वे बेटर देन अकम्पलिश डॉक्टर तो यहाँ पे ना माइंड सेट की क्लेंजिंग बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट है तो जब भी बच्चा ये कहता है कि मुझे ये करना है तो उसे मना करने के बजाय और ज्यादा उसके साथ रैपो बिल्डअप करके ये समझने की कोशिश करें कि वो वो क्यों करना चाहता है तो स्कूल के काउंसलर का यहाँ पे बहुत बड़ा रोल होता है कि हर बच्चे से बात करे समझे उसकी परेशानी क्या है एब्सोल्यूटली नॉट जस्ट स्कूल काउंसलर्स बट ऑफकोर्स पेरेंट्स स्कूल के काउंसलर्स तो है ही हैं बट पेरेंट्स का बहुत नहीं पेरेंट्स uh, बच्चों को स्कूल में छोड़ देते हैं दे थिंक हमारा काम हो गया आप बच्चे अपने आप ही सुधर जाए आज एक तो पेरेंट्स के पास टाइम नहीं है एक तो वो प्रॉब्लम है और दूसरा पेरेंट्स पेरेंटिंग का एक बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट एलिमेंट है जिसको मैं देखना पड़ेगा दट दे वॉन्ट टू फुलफिल देर ड्रीम्स थ्रू देर किड हाँ एब्सोल्यूटली तो मुझे मेरे बच्चे मैं चाहती हूँ मेरा बच्चा लिटरली फोर्स दैट ड्रीम्स ऑन दैट हाँ जी एंड देन देर इज ऑलवेज कॉन्फ्लिक्ट तो देन चिल्ड्रेन डोंट ओपन अप टू देयर पेरेंट्स और उन्हें क्योंकि दे दे कंटिन्यू टू स्ट्रगल सिंपली एंड दैट इज आल्सो वन ऑफ द रीजंस दैट दे स्ट्रगल एंड दे डोंट नो वेयर टू गो बिकॉज दे हैव दिस फियर दैट इफ आई टेल दिस टू माय पेरेंट्स और टू एनीबॉडी एल्स दे आर गोइंग टू यू नो नॉट सपोर्ट मी वन मिनट आई वांट टू आस्क द चिल्ड्रन एनी चाइल्ड आई वुड लव यू टू स्पीक चिल्ड्रन व्हाट दे आर सेइंग आर यू लाइकिंग इट इज इट रेजोनेटिंग आर यू अंडरस्टैंडिंग व्हाट वी आर सेइंग कैन यू टेल अस अबाउट योर एक्सपीरियंस एनीबॉडी लाइक वेयर यू वांटेड टू डू समथिंग एंड दैट्स Conflict of interest because of parents are forcing you to do something else. Please tell us. Are you passionate? I know it happens to everyone. No, this won't reach your parents. Don't worry. <laughs> we can solve it here. No, it's hypothetical. You need to put yourself in the position. Generally, what happens to your parents? घर घर से जाना है बाहर क्यों जाना है कितने बजे वापस आओगे हु वे यू वे ऑल दीज थिंग्स हैपन टू ऑल ऑफ अस डजेंट इट सो हाउ डू यू सॉल्व ऑल दैट सो दे डोंट वॉन्ट टू ओपन अप एज ऑफ नाउ आई मीन आई डोंट नो फॉर वॉट रीजन मैं एग्जाम्पल देती हूँ बहुत छोटा सा थ्री इडियट्स किसने किसने देखी है यहाँ पे रेज योर हैंड वाह वेरी नाइस तो उसमें फरहान डू यू रिमेम्बर द कैरेक्टर फरहान इंजीनियरिंग कर गया और उसके बाद उसने क्या किया फोटोग्राफी राइट एंड ही बिकेम सक्सेसफुल इन फोटोग्राफी सो इवेंचुअली वेस्टेड अ लॉट ऑफ टाइम इन इंजीनियरिंग वाई बिकॉज हिज पेरेंट्स वॉन्टेड हिम टू डू इंजीनियरिंग राइट अभी आप बोलोगे मैम ये तो मूवीज की एग्जाम्पल आप दे रहे हो हमें रियल टाइम एग्जाम्पल दो ये मूवीज की क्या बात दिस इज मेडिकल यूनिवर्सिटी वेर आई एम लीड कंसल्टेंट सो वंस आई जस्ट हैपन टू आज दिज एमबीबीएस नॉट एम बी बी एस इनफैक्ट पी जी स्टूडेंट्स पोस्ट ग्रेजुएशन कर रहे थे वो आई हैपन टू आज देम हाउ मेनी ऑफ यूर ऑफ यू आर यूर आउट ऑफ यू नो पैशन लोगों ने हाथ ऊपर किया बोले मैम वी आर फोर्स बिकॉज आर पेरेंट्स आर सक्सेसफुल डॉक्टर्स एंड वी आर फोर्स टू डू दिस एंड हेंस वी आर डूइंग इट एंड आई एज वेर इज योर पैशन वेर डज योर पैशन लाइ सो दे स्पोक अबाउट इंटीरियर दे स्पोक अबाउट फैशन एंड अदर इंडस्ट्रीज सो फोर्स करने पे आप शायद कुछ कर भी लोगे बट यूल नॉट बी एबल टू एंजॉय इट एंड यूल नॉट बी एबल टू सस्टेन इन टू दैट सो ये बहुत जरूरी है कि आप अपने आप को जाने कि आप क्या करना चाहते हो इट्स वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट ब्यूटिफुल काइंडनेस इज नॉट एन एक्ट बट ऑल्सो हैबिट सो यू बी काइंड अराउंड यू आई एम फ्रेड वीर रनिंग आउट ऑफ टाइम एंड कॉन्स्टेंटली आई मीन द मैसेज टूडे इज ऑफ गिविंग ऑफ ग्रेटिट्यूड ऑफ लविंग आई मीन हैबिट लाइक रीडिंग एंड लिस्निंग ऑल्सो डू इफेक्ट द सब कॉन्स माइंड and uh, in the end uh, we all have deep deep affection for technology and gadgets is there a single uh, way that we can keep uh, them out of our lives at least one day you think technology has made our lives easier nehal ji uh, yes absolutely technology has made our lives very very easy and uh, at the same time more competitive so the competition has also increased and there's just one thing that i'll tell be it uh, the gadget be it any person be it any process or system, 
system one thing which is very important is not being completely dependent on these so once you are not dependent on these things i think it's very easy to keep them away for a day for a week for a month so never put yourselves into anything be it gadget be it now i think most of students are teenagers here so don't invest yourself too much into any individual or any process or a system so just be independent and be consciously dependent on i think that's all and on that note i'd like to thank all of you for joining us today on this lovely christmas morning so and i know there are lots and lots of fun with saita that you'll have i'd like to thank uh, snehal uh, malpani ji for joining us and telling us ways to be grateful and i'd like to uh, thank the school uh, jnb bangalore for joining us like all time we request you to join us again next time on behalf of our ceo shrinivas ji i extend my sincere thanks to everybody who's here on this program and let's end with the true song of christmas joy to the world the lord has come so let's listen to that prasad <laughs> charge of dps will be with us and then we have the director general civil aviation captain neena joining us so we look forward to having you every week with uh, with us every sunday and special thanks to jnb bangalore for being so so regular i i don't know what all i'll do for you but you wait from cbsc what all i can get for you thank you so much namaste thank you everyone merry christmas thank you nidhi ji for having thank me Prasad. thank you thank you, thank you. Thank you. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas.